Yo guys and welcome to today's Hitman World of Assassination tutorial. In this video I will show you how to get this snail. It's an explosive sedative so if it explodes it will create a gas cloud and everyone standing in it will be put to sleep. This is especially useful if you want to sedate multiple people at once. To actually get the item though you need to own the 7 deadly sins DLC. If you have the DLC, go to the Dartmoor location and choose the Sloth Depletion Escalation. A little gimmick of this escalation is that if you move you lose health and if you have 0% left you die. You cannot choose a loadout, so I suggest we go right into the first level. Alright, Agent 47 will spawn in this snail shaped seat and then you will walk straight through the bushes Grab the wrench that's lying here on the box and grab the screwdriver that's there in the cabinet. With the screwdriver you will sabotage this wire so that the priest will walk into it and we can electrocute him. With the screwdriver you are also gonna eliminate this guard over there and with the wrench you will pacify the gardener so that he does not spot the guard. Then grab the screwdriver again and pacify this other guard. He won't get spotted if you are fast enough. On the way back you grab this knife and here you are waiting for the priest to walk to the puddle. Then after you vaulted this wall, throw the knife in this corner and enable the generator. The priest will be executed. Now you're good to go, but before you leave, wait for the exit sign to appear. If you exit early, the snail dude will keep talking and you have to wait unnecessary seconds, which will waste your precious time. Speaking of time, I know my tutorials are not really beginner friendly since they focus on getting a good time in the missions. I think it's interesting to see a different kind of tutorials than the good old Here is easy strat but it takes ages to finish. So if you wanna see more of speed focused videos, drop a comment specifying what item or mission you wanna see next. Alright, after completing level 1 of the escalation, you should now have the snail in your inventory. But don't click away yet, because I'm gonna show level 2 and 3 as well of the escalation. So I would say let's jump right into level 2. Alright, you will spawn once again in the snail shape cheat and you will locate the other snail behind the spawn. Then you will grab the sniper rifle, pop the head of the window washer, pop this uh, lock on the door and shoot once in a tank and once just a bit above, so that the guard will panic. Make sure you do it in this order, because the timing later on is quite important. Then you will grab this shuriken here, make sure to not get stuck here on the left side or get spotted. Um, instantly hide the shuriken or else you will be busted. Then throw the shuriken in this gardener's head, hide the gardener behind this table so the other gardener in this room will not spot him. Then walk across this little pavio thingy and behind this wall is a car battery. We will grab this as well. Make sure to leave a bit of a distance here to not get spotted. Oh, you're like some pea-brained greyhound. While on the way back to the third target, the lawnmower will explode. This will make everyone panic, including our last target, which we will then easily assassinate with the car battery. Now everyone's dead and we can leave the mission. Okay, and now to the last level. You cannot choose a loadout either, so I'm not gonna show this screen to you. Hello, Agent 47, for the last time in this video. You will walk straight to this window over there and grab the SMG that's there on the snail. On the way to there, you will grab this bust. We will need it later to smack some head. Then you will stand about here, so you can pop the door open without being spotted. And then you will shoot the chandelier down from this position. It might take a few tries. Then open this door also with the SMG and push this dude on the ground below you. 
Then you will head to the top floor. On the way out you can grab this banana, but you don't really need to. I mean it's a banana after all. Who doesn't like bananas? Alright, on the top floor arrived, you will go to the left side and then straight to the bathroom because there is a scissor which we will need. With the boss we grabbed earlier, you will pacify this cleaner and with the scissors you will kill this woman. Then you will head out, but make sure this cleaner on the hallway does not spot you. If you did everything correct so far, the timing will align perfectly and the jogger will walk down there. This is the only map which I did the jogger, because it's just so conveniently placed. Then here also make sure that you don't get spotted and that the target is below the chandelier. Then you will walk back to the spawn point, shoot there to distract the guards and then after you arrived in the last room you can shoot the chandelier down once again and exit the mission. Alright, you now completed all three levels of the slow escalation. I hope this video helped you. If so, remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such videos.